Hi everybody. Hello. 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 Nice to see everyone. Okay, May is probably joining us after two weeks. But um, let's see. Until then, we're still missing some people, right? Who are we missing? Valentina, definitely. Oh, yeah. Anyone else? Um, Zui. Oh, yeah. Zui. Zui had to see me today, but we had some misunderstanding and he went to see me somewhere else. <laughs> so, so they came to some other place and we told them, no, I'm not there. Oh, we don't have time. <laughs> So I will probably see Tiri again, right? In when I come to Florida next. I didn't next week. know that, but okay. Yeah, I'm not sure if I understood what your mom told me, but. Um, I guess I could ask my mom after this class, and I guess she can lie to you. So I have already renamed your class to grade two, not in Viber, but at least in my attendance sheet. And I will gradually uh, rename you everywhere where it's needed to grade two, because there will be one more grade waiting for you. So for today, uh, we have five people just like yesterday and just like the last week. Visitors allow um, CC to visit him. Mm-hmm. She can. She's welcome. You're welcome. You can just say hello, and if you're too shy, you can go if you want. Hi. Hi. It's a little lighter to put your palms together and say hello, Venerable Sir. Hello, Venerable Sir. Nice Hi. to see you, CC. Nice to see you too. The mug allows visitors. Yeah. yeah? The mug allows visitors, Mimi. Yeah. Okay, I hope that my grandma didn't misunderstand. Well, you have to sit on your knees with your hands like this and listen. I will. And not talk. I will. And not talk and listen to me. I was telling her to say hello. Can you leave the door open and you can whisper because I want to hear what's going on up there. Okay. This is serious. You need to kneel down and respectfully and you need to laugh. Okay. You have to obey your cousin. Some additional instructions from your grandma? Yes. Yes, Venerable Sir. Okay. So I will have to also check the homework uh, of those who didn't come. Okay, I think I need to go get my homework. It's just in the corner of the bookshelf. Okay, I'm waiting. Oh wait, did I grab? Oh yeah, I grabbed something else. This is very good. Thank you. Oh. Okay. If you ever want to leave, you can. Just, I'm just, if you ever want to leave. Okay. All right, I think we are ready. So let's get into recitation. Everybody can unmute. Keep your hands together at the chest. Just saying. Yamahan Vada Mitang Vadeta. Okay. Now you can repeat after me. Aham Bhante. Aham Bhante. Tisara Nina Saha. Tisara Nina Saha. 
Pancasilan Brahman Yajami. Pancasilan Brahman Yajami. And this, oh, uh, we actually can do, did we do Burmese last week? Okay. I think so. so. Yeah. Yes, we did. So, um, be careful. Ya cha me. Emily, try it. Ya cha me. Ya cha Ya cha Okay. It's different from Burmese. In Burmese, it is Ya Sami. In Sinhalese, in Sri Lankan language, it is Ya Jami. Sri Lankan pronunciation of Pali language. So let's try it again. Aham Bhanti. Aham Bhanti. Tisara Nena Saha. Tisara Nena Dhammang ya jami. Dhammang ya jami. katva. Silang de tame bhante. Silang de tame Anukampang upadaya. Anukampang upadaya. Duti Dutiyampi <laughs> Anu kampang upadaya. Tati yampi aham bhante. Tati yampi aham bhante. Tisara nena saha. Tisara nena saha. Panca silang dhammang ya jami. Panca silang dhammang ya jami. Anu gahang katwa. Silang de tame bante. Silang de upadaya. Namota sabhagavato arahato samma sambuddhasa. Emily, I think you were missing it. Can you say it yourself one time? Namo. Namo Tassapagavato. Yeah, yeah, that's the Burmese pronunciation. In Sri Lankan, you would say Sama Sambuddhasa. Sama Sambuddhasa. Okay. Nice. So let's continue. Buddhang Saranangga Chami Dhammang Saranangga Chami Sanghang Saranangga Chami. So I think Emily, Emily is confused. It is Gachami. Can you say that? Gachami. That's right. Buddhang Saranang Gachami. Dhammang saranang gachami. Dhammang saranang gachami. So here we have this ah sound, and it's everywhere. But uh, uh, except the Buddha, except the Buddha, everywhere else it is ah 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 ah. ah. So you have Buddha, Saranang, Gachami. Oh, at the end you have I, that's true. I, Gachami. 
Dhammansaranam gachami Sanghansaranam gachami Do you see it? So uh, yeah. see if you can try. Buddhang saranang gachami. Amen. Amen. Buddhang saranang gachami. Buddhang. Buddhang saranang gachami. You see, you are not you are not pronouncing the a properly. It needs to be a. All right. So. Um, so we have um, we have a song in Czech, you know, Holka modro oka nesedave upotoka, which means, oh little lady of blue eyes, don't sit close to the pond, because um, uh, how do you call it? Because a water goblin may come and take you in the water. So that's a little song we have. And then the children have to play. Helke medre eke nese deve epeteke. Hilki midri iki nisi divi ipitiki. Halka madra aka nasadava apataka. Okay? See if you can do that. Okay? We will try it with, with some sentence. And you need to train that. You need to be able to do this. Very basic skill of kids, like five-year-old kids, six-year-old kids. You're much older than that, okay? You need to have that skill. So let's take one sentence. For example, it's a little bit difficult in English because English is a little more complicated than that. But we can take definitely a Pali, a Pali sentence. What would be a good Pali sentence for that? For example, uh, let's take Pali sentence. Panati pata vera mani sikha padang samadhya. So it would be panata patang vara mana sakha patang samadayama. And then you have penete. <laughs> no? So you need to change it into the different vowels. So see if you can do it. Just the first word. Panati pata. So now we want to do it. Panata pata. Penete pete. Piniti piti. Mm? So, Andre, can you do it? A E I O U. Okay, so A. Um. Panata pata. No, first A. Panata pata. Panata pata. Mm -hmm. Now. Um. Penete, penete, um, penete, um, penete, um, penete, no, 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 penete, penete, must be complete. Penete, penete, yes, I, now I, I, hmm, P, pen. Pene te pete. Pini ti piti. Pini ti piti. Yes, you can do it. Oh. Puni. No, no, no. Oh. Pa. Pa na to pa to. That's right. U. U nu tu pu tu. Yes, you can do it. Emily, see if you can do A. Ah. Uh. Panat, 
P N T P T. Then P P P. We like pop. P N T P T. P N T P T. Yes, you can do that. Hi. E. It's probably you should. Mm -hmm. B. Try it, Emily. B. Now you're doing B. B ni. B ni. What am I doing? Yes, you are saying the word pana pipata with taking all vowels as I. So you start B and then you change na into ni. And then you change ta into ti. So you have pi ni ti. And then what comes? Pi ni ti. Pi ni ti. Pi ni. No. Try it again. Pi ni ti. Yeah, I knew. You, it's more difficult for you than for the other students. So, what is the basic? Pana tipata, right? Do you agree? Yes. So you get you got pana tipa. What remains? Pana tipa. Pa. Ta, that's right. Now, how will you change it? Ta into? T. That's right. So, how it is? Pi ni. Now, with I, how do you say it? Pi ni ti. Pi ni ti. Pi ni ti. Yes, you got it. Nice. Now, with O. Pa. Pa no no to po to. That's right. And U. U. Well, don't help her. Hey, oh. this is not fair. Oh. She oh, needs okay. to learn herself. Right. Oh, yes, sorry. Emily? <laughs> yes, Emily, I'm listening to you. Who? <laughs> yes, that's right. So now we, if we have Gachami, you see? So we can say with A, it is ga. Chama. Gecheme. Gichimi. Gochomo. Guchumo. Alright? So now try it, Emily. Gachami with A. Gachami. Gachama. Mm -hmm. E. Cham. Gachami. No. That's right. E. G. That's right. O. Go. Show me. No. No. Uh, it's just all, 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 right? So how do you say? Gochomo. That's right, gochomo. U, bu. Gochomo. That's right, gochomo. Nice. Didi, where did you go? Sorry, so, I'm just off to the side. Yes, I noticed. So, how's um, uh, Panati Pata? Can you say with A, E, E, O, E? Pana. A. Pana. Pata. Pata. That's right. A. Uh, no. B. B. No. B. B. No. B. 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 No. B. No. B. 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 You must re retain this e. Pene. Pene de pene. Mm -mm, not ne. 
What's at the end? Pa na ti? Pa? Pa? That's right. So how will you change it into a? And that's a p. No, pe, not p. Pe ti. No, we maintain a. Again, pe ne. Pe ne te pe te. That's right. E. E. Wasn't that just e? No, that was a. Now you're going to e. Oh. Perfect. Oh. Bono de bodo. No. Try it again. Bono de. No. Oh, bono de bodo. That's right. U. Bono de bodo. Mm -mm. What's at the end of the word? Panati pa? T. No, panati pa. Oh, ta. That's right. So, how will you say it with u? U? Unu ti pu. No, not e. U. Unu ti pu. No. Oh, unu ju pu. Unu. Ju? That's right. Now, Tensa, you have it the easiest. You have heard it so many times. Ah. Pa. Um, let's see. <laughs> I haven't pa. even. Yeah. Pa. You know the word panati pata, right? Do you know it? Yes. So just say the same, but all of the vowels will be a. Pan. Pa. A. Pana. Pana. Tu. A. Pana. A. Mm hmm. Uh, 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 Anna. Anna. Ah. So the normal is Pana Tipata, right? Yeah, Pana Tipata. That's right. And now you change all of those vowels into A. Pana. Uh, mm, that's correct. And then? Uh, da. Yeah, you've already said it. And then? Yeah. It's the same thing. It's the same thing. There's no change. Banata. Banata. Da. No, there's something missing. You you missed a bit of What's the normal one? What's the normal one? Anatipata. Yes, and the only thing that you change is T because the else is A already. So you just change T into Ta. So it is what? Pana. Pana. Ta. Pana Ta. And then? What is after panati? Uh -huh. Sorry? Uh -huh. no, that's not enough. There are five things, right? Panati pata, right? Five things. So pana, then? Pana. You've already said it like four times. <laughs> that's right. And then comes? Yes. <laughs> Pa. Yes, pa. Ta. Yes, of course. So say it again. Pa na ti pa. No, not ti. No. Pa, pa na ta ta. Pa ta. Yes, pa na ta pa ta. 
It's so difficult. It's so easy. Okay. A. B. 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 It's easy. Uh, you just change the vowel, so you had bana tapata. Now you will have pe, and then so the second one was na, right? So what will it be now? Ni. No, you are working with e. So from now becomes <laughs> what? Yes, ne. So it is what pe ne, and then the third one was. Ta, right? So what becomes from ta? Te. That's right. And then what was the syllable? Pa. That's right. And what it becomes from pa? Te. Yes. And then what was the last syllable? What was the last syllable? Os. Ta. Yeah, ta. So what becomes from ta? Ke. Yeah, that's right. So now can you say it together? Okay, so... <laughs> so, pe. 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 Yes, and then? Te. Se. Ke. No, there is no K in the word panatipata. <laughs> Can I just use any, any sounds you want? So from panatapata, you get pene. Te. Yes, te. No, not there is no S in there. Yamona, I will uh, I will give you some time, Tenza. Now look, look at how Yamona will be doing. So Yamona, how do you say it with A? Panati pana pana. Pata. That's right, panata pata with e. Perfect. E. Pini piti pi. No, try it again. Piti pi. Pini. Pini ti piti. Perfect. O. Po. 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 Mm -hmm. Po. No. Po. Mm -hmm. po. Yes. Po. No. To. Mm -hmm. So, pono to. Pono to photo. Perfect. U, u. Pono putu. U. Pono putu. That's right. Pono to putu. Very well. Thank you, Yamona. Now let's go and get back to Tenza. So, how do you say it with Ah? Better on the I feel like the younger you are, the easier it is. Sorry? I feel like the younger you are, the easier it is to convert the vowels. Because you're not attached. That's right. You're younger, so you're not attached to the idea that it must be like this. No. You know? Because you're young, so you're more open to things that they can be a different way. When you're in your age, uh, of you, Andre and Emily and Tenza, you feel like this is the way we were taught, so it always must be like that. You see? Because it is a little safe. You just follow what the other person says, so it's a little safe. You cannot make much mistake, all right? But as you get older and older, you will learn 
that actually it is possible to make mistakes and it is possible to play. So see if you can play a little. So turns out. Ah. Hmm? Pa? Pa 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 What's the normal word? What's the original word? Pa na ti pa ta. Yes. And what will you change? What is now pa is with a, right? Do you agree? Yes. Na is with a, right? Do you agree with that? Mm -hmm. T is with a. Do you agree with that? Mm -hmm. That's correct. Mm -hmm. So, how will you change T? Uh. That's right, into ta. Pa is with a. Do you agree with that? Yeah. And ta is with a. Do you agree with that? So, what is the only thing that you change? Uh. T the T. T into ta, right? So how will you say the word again with a only? Pa. Uh, uh, ta. Pa, ta. Yeah. You see, it's not that difficult. You only change T into ta, and then the same, the, the rest is the same. Pa na ti pa ta is the original. Pa na ta pa ta is the next, is the a, a version. Is it clear, Tenza? I cannot see your face. Can you adjust your camera? Okay. So I think you're a little tired of that. So then we have E, right? So how will you say it with E? So that means that now from this new version, Pana Tapata, all of them will be changed from A into E. So you get Pe, Ne, Te, pe, te. Can you say it? Pe, ne. I just say it. You just repeat after me. Pe, ne. Pe, te, te. <laughs> okay, try it again. Pe, ne, te. Pe, ne, te. Pe, te. Can you see it? From pa na te pa ta, we made pe ne te pe te. Is it clear what we did? Um. Seems like it's a little too difficult for you. Okay, you can think about it. Anyway, this was for Emily. So, Emily. When I uh, say gacha me, then you cannot say gachi me or gicha me. No, it doesn't work. Gacha me, or in Burmese, it is gisa me. You see, that's the difference that I wanted to show you, Emily. All right, so when we say bodhan tarana gisa me, we used e a e in gisa me. Do you hear it there, Emily? Can you say it again? I yes. didn't really hear. Now, now, can you hear me well? Yes. Okay. So when we say gisa me, you're using the vowels e a e. Can you hear it there? What are the vowels yes. in gisami? What are they? Um, gisami. No, in the Burmese version, gisami. The Burmese version, gisami. What are the vowels there? I. Mm -hmm. A. Mm -hmm. 
I. Perfect. Very well. Now, in the Sri Lanka version, it is different. It is gachami. What are the vowels in gachami? A. A. E. A. A. E. A. A. I. Okay. So, gachami. All right. So, Burmese has gisami. Sri Lankan has, has gachami. Your task is only to repeat. Nothing difficult. All right. So just make sure that you repeat correctly. Can you say Buddhang Saranang Gachami? Buddhang Saranang Gachami. But I feel like you say Saranang. We don't want Saranang. We want Saranang. Okay. So try it again. Buddhang Saranang Gachami. Buddhan Saranan Gachami. Yeah, looks good. Dhamman Saranan Gachami. Dhamman Saranan Gachami. Perfect. Sanghan Saranan Gachami. Chami Sankan Saranan Gachami 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 Yes, very well. Sometimes you you don't pronounce it, you know, fully. We want this A ah, strong A ah, Gachami. Okay. So, Emily, do you think you will remember until next time? Yes. You will try. You can train. You can train that every day. Buddhang Sarah, when you uh, do you uh, do you recite uh, something in front of your in front of your Buddha statue? Um, I think I did yesterday, but um, I don't do it often. I see. Do you meditate every day, Emily? Almost every day. Almost every day. Whenever you meditate, you can write before your meditation, you can say, Buddhan Saranan Gachami, Dhammang Saranan Gachami, Sanghan Saranan Gachami. All right. So that will be a pretty good training until next time. But next time we are <laughs> reciting in Burmese. So. Uh, you will need to train for two weeks uh, to, to show that you can know it. You can do it. Okay. Didi is gone. I think Didi was pretty sad, right? That she was not able to do it. Okay. So, well, that's the way it is. You know, life is difficult. If you don't learn the things that are difficult, well, then what will you learn? Learning is always difficult. You cannot, like, expect that everything is easy. Yeah. Cece is saying something? What is it? She's talking about something she learned. Um, okay. In school. Something she learned in school. Okay, fine. Is that related um, to taking refuge no. in the Buddha Dhamma Sangha? No, she was just saying that because you were speaking about learning. That, yeah. that, that's why she was speaking. I, I believe she was speaking to me. You can ask her, what did she mean? Um, what did you say? You can ask Sissy, what did she mean? Um, she was just talking about the homophones. Um, Sissy, was there anything you needed? No. no. Was there anything you needed? <laughs> can you ask Sissy what was she saying? Oh, what were you saying? Um... Um, that I, I learned about homophones in school. What did you um, learn? About um, homophones. About she, homophones? And she was giving me an example about the baking flour and the plant flour, I think. Was, yes? Yeah. 
Yeah, right now she's drawing. I let her use one page out of my book. She wants to... D also, now, may I please say something else? Yes, please. She wishes to join us for the meditation. Okay. And she's drawing until then. Okay. Tell me if you need anything else, okay? Okay. Okay. Okay, she's... She's... While she's doing that... Um, I'm done talking now. All right. So, so uh, we need Tenza to come so that we can continue. What shall we do? So let's continue anyway. You can keep your hands together at the chest. And we are going to do Dutiyampi Tatiyampi. So make sure you pronounce this correctly. Dutiyampi Buddhang Saranangat Chami Dutiyampi Dhammang Saranangat Chami Dutiyampi Sanghang Saranangat Chami. Dutiyampi Tati yampi buddhang saranangat chami tati yampi dhammang saranangat chami tati yampi sanghang saranangat chami tati yampi buddhang Perfect. Yes, Emily, you're doing well. Sarana gamanang paripunang. Ama bama te matan. All right. So, so we don't have tenza. What should we do? Uh oh. I think I have discouraged Tenza. <laughs> uh oh, that that that's definitely. <laughs> that's sure. <laughs> definitely clear. It's wait wait. You actually did. Yeah, Tenza is not here, so why oh, did well, she leave? I think about it. Well, I guess that makes sense, or she could have gone to get something, like I was getting a pen for Cece. Quickly. Does it take too long to get a pen? Oh yeah, that's true. Or if she lost something, and she was looking for that, sure like enough. maybe a book, or you a pen. <laughs> no, surely not. Well, there's a million pens, so how would it be a pen? <laughs> Why now during recitation? I am sure that she didn't lose anything. And we will have soon the teenagers coming in, so we didn't uh, look at the homework. Oh, Tensa is crying. Mm. Amazing. So I think we will go uh, to uh, to the precepts. Okay. So you can repeat after me. Uh, okay, so let's do this together. This uh, Sarana gamanang paripunang. Amabana pante. Panati pata vera manisika padang samadiyami. Panati pata vera manisika padang samadiyami. Uh, so, what does that mean, Andre? Um, I refrain from killing living beings. Yes. Adinna dana vera manisikha padang samadhyami. Adinna dana vera manisikha padang Emily, what does that mean? No stealing. Mm -hmm, that's right. Kame sumicha chara vera manisikha padang samadhyami. So, Yamona, what does that mean? No cheating on your wife or husband. 
That's right. Musa vada vera mani sikha padang samadhyami. Musa vada vera mani sikha padang samadhyami. So what does that mean, Tiri? Uh, no lie. That's right. Sura mera yamajja pamada thana vera mani sikha padang samadhyami. Uh, Surah Mera Yamaja Pamadatana Vera Pamadatana Sikha Padam Smadyam Yamona, can you say that? Surah Mera Surah Mera Yamaja Pamadatana Surah Mera Yamaja Sikha Padam Smadyam No, no, no Sura Meraya Majja. Sura Meraya Majja. Pamada Tana. Pamada Tana. Vera Manisi. Sikha Vadam Dhamadeya. Very well. Tisaranena Sadhing Pancha Silang Dhammang Sadhukang Surakhitang Katva Appamadena Sampadetha. Amabandhi. Amabandhi. Okay, very well. So, Yaza, are you here with us? Meditation is about to start. We are waiting for Yaza and Sandy. The meditation. Denza is looking at uh, is looking at us from afar. I'll tell you what. Denza, are you coming? Oh. Should we get our cameras ready? Um, yep. Yes? Get ready your camera. Okay. Yes, right now, sir. Oh, my God. So, Mamiyaki, what do you think? Do you think that Tenza will join us or no? Um, sorry, Shunta, Tenza doesn't be quite ready. I'm trying to calm her. Okay, okay. <laughs> I uh, I didn't notice that uh, it was too much on her. Well, she gets frustrated sometimes. <laughs> oh, did, oh, is this not the first time? Did she get frustrated sometime? Yeah. I see. Okay. Well, um She'll be here soon. Come on, Tenza, it's okay. I didn't I didn't tell her that there's anything wrong. I didn't blame her or did he, did I blame Tenza for anything? I don't believe so. No 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 you did not. No, that I didn't tell her anything I, wrong. I you didn't. did not. She I I was just Trying to encourage her to try again and again and again and again and again, and then she started to cry. <laughs> yeah, it's so frustrating. Yeah, frustrated with herself. She 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 needs some time to calm herself down. And she's okay. There. Okay. Well, she can mute herself and meditate with us. Maybe that will help her to calm. She can Do turn not, off yeah. the. You can turn off the video if that helps. She can join us in meditation. Um. Yes, Tiri. 
Um, CC wishes not to do the meditation anymore. Okay, and in that case, please uh, ask C make sure that your room is empty and close the door. Um, CC, uh, could you please bow down to the monk okay. three times, this time not one? Okay. Thank you. And can you also say goodbye to the normal sir? Just it's not better. Goodbye, normal sir. Nice. Goodbye, CC. See you next time. Bye. She's going to be the whole week here, the whole week. I don't know if she'll see you next Saturday or she or if she's leaving before the evening or something. I don't know. No problem. How old is CC? Um, she's five. She's turning six this August. Mm -hmm. Three days after my um, birthday celebration, which is August 22nd. Well, maybe not the celebration, but my birthday, and hers is on August 25th. Of course, there are a few years apart, too, but, um, yeah. Okay, Cece, you cannot lie down in front of a monk, <laughs> so you don't have to sit if you want to be there. Please, please, please. Cannot, cannot lie down, no, no. You can lie down downstairs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or, or if I close the door. Yeah, or if you close the door, that's right. Okay, I didn't close the door enough. Okay, and I... Well, I guess she, she was shy at the very beginning. She didn't want to do it, but then she changed her mind. And... Okay, so I will uh, ask everybody except Tensa to turn on their video. Okay, make sure your back is erect, side cast down, and we can make the first determination in our minds voicelessly from now on for 15 minutes. I will meditate on muscles and radiate loving-kindness without any movement. I see Yamuna is not ready. That's just sitting there. Ew, that's not my name. I can see Yamona there, and that's you, right, Yamona? Mm -hmm. You're not yeah. Yamona. Yeah, you're. You are. The name is there. It's correct. But you need to adjust the camera so we can see your legs, hands, and face. Oh, oh I'm not needed. Oops. Sorry. Yes, nice, nice, that's pretty good. So Yamona, this is not a meditation posture. Can you sit in a meditation posture? Okay, that looks better. And uh, Yamona, you need to keep your back erect. It seems you're a little slouching. All right, Yamona, two things you need for meditation, no movement. Keep the back erect, all right? So make sure you don't move at all during meditation practice. So now we are waiting for Andre. <laughs> okay, Andre, let's start. So we can keep our eyes open. We cast the side down. We make the determination from now on for 15 minutes. I will meditate on muscles and radiate loving kindness without any movement. From now on for 15 minutes, I will meditate on muscles and radiate loving kindness without any movement. From now on for 15 minutes, I will meditate on muscles and radiate loving kindness without any movement. And we can gently lovingly notice the flat piece of flesh at the top of the head. We allow it to be heavy. 
and changing. We continue to the forehead, eyes, nose, lips, chin, cheeks, Ears, back of the head. We allow all of the muscles and flesh throughout the head to be heavy. And changing. We continue to the neck, shoulders, arms, elbows, Forearms, wrists, palms, fingers. Tips of fingers, chest, abdomen, back, we allow all of the muscles and flesh throughout the upper part of the body to be heavy and changing. We continue to the buttocks, <coughs> thighs, Knees, calves, heels, soles, toes. Tips of toes. We allow all of the muscles and flesh throughout the body to be heavy and changing. And we enjoy this heaviness 
we enjoy this change. We give freedom to the body to be the way it is. And as we give freedom to the body to be the way it is, we enjoy the freedom from worry about the body. And with that freedom comes peace. Now let's share this peace with other living beings. We can start in our room. May all beings in this room be in peace. May all beings in this building be in peace. May all beings in this city or village be in peace. May all beings in this country be in peace.
May all beings on this planet be in peace. May all beings, including me, be in peace. May all beings, including me, be in peace. You watch the relationship between the mind and the permission that all beings are in peace. Is the permission and the mind the same thing? Are they close or are they far away? Is this relationship pleasant or unpleasant? We want to know. Now, because the time for this sitting is finished, let's make the last determination. From now on, I will always be calm. From now on, I will always be calm. From now on, I will always be calm. And we can slowly, mindfully change the way of our sitting. Stay where you are, you're not moving yet, just changing the posture. And we can take one more minute during which we will 
Just watch the peace in the mind without making any movement at all. Very well. So, our grade two students did not read any homework. And that means that you have no homework for next week. Mm. So you can enjoy your time. And you can train. Buddhang Saranangachami. Dhammang Saranangachami, Sanghang Saranangachami. And then Za can train. Pana tapata, Pene te pete, Pini ti piti, Pono to poto, Punu to budu. So let's see if Tenza can master that. You have seven days for that. It would actually help much if uh, if you write it down. Okay. So if Tenza writes it down and then if she reads it, it will be much easier than doing it, you know, by heart. Yeah. It's a little more training. No problem. No need to be sad if you cannot do something. What's needed is to work harder. That's all. It takes more time, but, you know. How do you think I learned Burmese, you know? If I cried upon uh, ten times after forgetting the same word, how would I have memorized 40,000 words? It would not work. Okay. So we learn, forget, learn, forget. We try, fail, try, fail. And what's up? So we try and try and try and try thousand times, ten thousand times, hundred thousand times until we just get it. Maybe it doesn't work today. No problem. We'll work tomorrow. Doesn't work tomorrow. No problem. We'll try it the other day. All right. We never give up. Yes, did he? It's actually a good timing that I don't have homework because this is the week that my friend is sitting and she's going to be sitting the whole week. So. You're happy? Didi, you're happy? No homework? Emily? But I do like so, homework. I have, I have a Burmese class, and um, I think I've tried about like four times, not understanding what my teacher means. Yeah, Burmese, like, no, do not think you will understand. You will not. <laughs> it's just that simple. <laughs> so, you, so you just uh, hear what the teacher says, and you ask, is there something I should memorize? <laughs> so then just memorize what the teacher says and you say it wrong and what's up? Later you will understand. Maybe you will not. Doesn't matter. Burmese is so difficult. You don't even have to expect that you will learn it one day. There's no need. The idea is that you try. Try, you know? And if you have the luck to learn, well, then you will learn one day. You know, not everybody uh, can understand Burmese, you know, within a first month. But I know one lady in Myanmar who is not Burmese at all. And she was just listening to the people speaking in Burmese. And now she can speak in Burmese. Mm -hmm. Shortcut. Yes, Didi? Did you already know a few words? 
I don't or, know. I think they just taught her in English, you know, what they mean. And because she had to use these words again and again and again, you know, because she was just hanging out with her friends. Uh, because she had to use the words again and again, then it was easier to understand. Hard to tell. When I learn language, I first have to learn how to write it. Then I have to learn grammar. Then I have to learn thousands and thousands of, voc of vocabulary. And then I start to use it. And so then I go grandma, through a course book and another course book and another course book. I usually have to do three textbooks before I move on to reading books. So I first uh, finish about like three textbooks of that subject or of that language. And when I have mastered all of the three textbooks, so you have like one textbook, you know, with let's say 20 lectures or 30 lectures. And then you go, you learn the vocabulary, you learn the grammar. So like this, I need to finish three textbooks to understand a language well. And then I move on to reading books in that language. Some small, you know, like cartoon books or simple books for children and things like that. And then after I feel that I can clearly understand you know, these books that are made for children or that are with pictures, I move on to harder books. So books about history, books about uh, Buddhism, books about religions and so on in that language. So this is how I learned English, Burmese, Sinhalese, Pali, French. Now I'm learning Vietnamese. So um, I will have 10 days to learn Vietnamese uh, from August 1 to August 10. I will be just dedicating myself to Vietnamese. We'll probably not have a class. And I will have eight hours of studying, of memorizing vocabulary every single day. So that after those 10 days, I can already talk in Vietnamese. I need 10 days to start talking in a language. 10 days is enough. But I need to know the script before that. So I need 10 days to learn language because my system is very well developed. But I need to dedicate like the full days should, I should not have there anything else. Otherwise, uh, it's broken. It doesn't work. So that's my August 1 to 10. I will be learning Vietnamese and hopefully August 11, I will be speaking in Vietnamese. Yes, Didi? My grandma is talking in Burmese and she says that if she doesn't, Oh, speaking of my grandma, I just remembered a question I had also. Mm. Yeah. But I'm going to finish what I had to say. So my grandma, she says that if she doesn't, if that, if that she doesn't um, explain to me in English, and if I just listen, she thinks I will learn because I, well, I do know some words like fruits and, yeah. It's just, I think it's harder if she doesn't explain. Hmm. Yeah. Everybody learn, need to, you, all of you need to learn Burmese, like it or not. You know, it's not something, you know, voluntary. You're Burmese, so you need to know Burmese. You know, imagine, makes... like, um, you will go to Myanmar and people will say, Oh, you're Burmese. Mengala ba. Mengala. Sabi bila. You need to understand. Very good accent. And I might be like, Megla, what? <laughs> and if, if you don't if understand, don't that's learn, ridiculous. I'll, I'll be like Bidou. that. Bidou. Bidou. Yes, Andre? Um, um, I'm good at writing and I'm good at, um, I'm semi good at understanding and I'm yes. good at also eating. Um, so I just need to know how to, I, I need to, I need to work on speaking. Yeah, ideally like you I'm, listen to music and you watch uh, movies all in Burmese. I'm not good at music. And I'm if not you good can, anything. if you can tune in to radio, to Burmese radio, then that's pretty good. Uh, you can also listen to Dhamma teachings of Burmese monks, but that's the hardest Burmese. It's very common that Burmese will go to Dhamma teaching and they have no clue what it, what, we, what it was about. So one day, you know, a nun, you know, uh, a Burmese nun um, went to Dhamma teaching of Yo Siado, of the great monk in Myanmar. And I didn't come. I couldn't come. So then the next day in the morning, I met the nun and I said, Oh, venerable nun, what did you learn from that Dhamma teaching? And he says, well, I didn't understand anything. But 
the monk is Burmese and you are Burmese and the teaching was in Burmese. So how is that possible? And that's probably because his pronunciation, you know, is not, um, is not the same as the nun's pronunciation. So, uh, so that's the thing um, that a Burmese uh, language is very complicated. You will learn all of the Burmese, you will understand all of the Burmese, you will learn all of the grammar, and you still have no idea what the people talk about when they speak. And the people also will not understand what you mean. Just get ready for that. I learned Burmese, you know, for like one year, and I was able to read and write basically anything. But when I spoke, people didn't understand me, and when people spoke, I didn't understand them. But I could speak, you know what I mean? Like, I said what I want to say, but they just didn't understand it. And they said what they want to say, I didn't understand it. But when they wrote it, I could understand it all. The Burmese pronunciation is sloppy. That means it's not accurate. And because it's not accurate, you have to learn basically two languages. You have to learn the written language and also the spoken pronunciation, because the pronunciation doesn't really follow the written language very often. So you have to get a lot and a lot of habit. It took me about four or five years to learn Burmese very well. And four or five years means learning every day or almost every day, five hours, seven hours, memorizing and memorizing and memorizing vocabulary. Yes, Emily? I can answer about like three questions you asked. Um, Yes, Andre, you wanted to say something? Yamona wanted to say something. Yamona, what did you want to say? I never wanted to say anything. Okay. Yamona, can you speak in Burmese? Um, well, kind of. Kind of. <laughs> so, I suggest that all of you ask your parents for cartoon books. There are beautiful cartoon books in Burmese. Amazing cartoon books in Burmese. A huge, huge amount of cartoon books in Burmese about Buddhism, about Burmese culture, about Burmese... Um, Wow, Burmese cartoons, wow, they're so rich. I myself have such a large collection of Burmese cartoons. You can't imagine. I have maybe, I don't know, maybe 50 or 100 cartoon books that are in Burmese. And many of them I read. I learned Burmese from the cartoon books, by the way. <laughs> because they use you know, the spoken language. It's, it's more practical to learn Burmese from the cartoon books. And it's very easy and I, so engaging. Yes, Yamona? I can't understand Burmese writing. Okay, you can understand Burmese writing? That's pretty good. I can't. Uh, you cannot? Okay, well, then you have to learn. Did he? I think I have a lot of cartoon books. Are they in Burmese? Well, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, in Burmese, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's good. Well, maybe not a lot. Well, I have some, and and there's also this poem book, or I think it's like a poem book. Ha one half is Burmese, and the other half is English. Like, half the page would be in Burmese, the other half would be in English. The translation, not, not like, half Burmese. Half of the sentence is Burmese, not, no, and half English, no, not like that, not like that. Just the writing in Burmese and the translation in English on one page. Yeah, I will show you my collection of my Burmese cartoons. Hopefully I can inspire you all to read Burmese cartoons. So these are some, I have many more, but these are just some of my favorite, uh, which are um, uh, with the drawings from Myo Man, Myo Man Pichi. All right. So Myoma and Pichi, they're so beautiful. They're filled with such an, uh, 
such a huge amount of very important information. This, for example, is Bagan Kemenya. What is Bagan Kemenya? Emily, what does that mean? No idea? Yeah, it's a little difficult, that's true. Yamona, do you know what is Bagan Kemenya? No. No? Bagan. Is Bagan. Is Bagan. It's your city in, in Myanmar. It's the famous city of the many pagodas. Ke means era. Menya are kings, the kings of the Bagan era. So uh, this particular cartoon is about Anoyata Men and Jansita Men, the kings, the king Anorata and the king Jansita. And then uh, you get you get uh, the stories here. Uh, let's see where does it start. Okay, here it is. Beautiful pictures, cute pictures with a little bit of English translation, which is not very reliable and very bad in grammar and spelling, but it's pretty helpful, you know, when you're learning Burmese. So uh, then you have there, you know, the Burmese and a little bit of English help, Burmese, English help. Like for learning Burmese, this is amazing. I have learned so much of Burmese from this. So you get page after page with beautiful pictures describing to you uh, the history and culture and uh, Buddhism. For example, this one is Teye Tisse Mensa Balu. So Teye are ghosts. Tisse is one kind of ghosts. Mensa is yet another kind of ghosts. And Balu are ogres. So uh, this uh, cartoon is only about ghosts. So you have their stories of ghosts. And uh, again, you have Burmese and a little bit of English help so that if you don't understand Burmese, you can understand English. Let's see something else. This again, Pieta. Let's see something else. Arya Miete Ya Feyatamai. So this is about the Buddha Metteya, the Buddha that's coming in the future. So here we learn uh, what we know about Buddha Metteya from the cartoons. I love them so much. Like these are my favorite cartoons. I'm just so happy about them. So if you get, uh, you can ask your parents if you want, Myo Man Pichi. Newman Pichi. So uh, these are uh, some of the most the cutest and most uh, suitable cartoons. Um, and most importantly, they are about Burmese culture, history, and about Buddhism. So you definitely need to know it all. You need to know all of the. You need to read them all. I also need to read them all. Like if you don't read them, you're missing basic information. If your parents buy it in Myanmar. I'm willing to send you the electronic version. Okay, so that way you can actually get them very easily. So you can ask your parents if you want the cartoons and they will say, but that's very hard to bring them from Myanmar to the US. So you can say no, you can buy them in Myanmar and Ashin Sarana will send us the electronic version. So you get it immediately as it's popped. I can send you the PDF. All right. Okay, so we didn't read any homework because one of you did not prepare the homework and uh, another people did not come. So, but we had longer class definitely for the preteens and uh, we have much shorter class for the teens. And, but I still think that, I would, that what I told you is somewhat helpful. Uh, when you learn Burmese, do not expect that you will learn Burmese. That helps so much. You know, because you, you know, after I learned like one, two, three years of Burmese and I found out that nobody understands me and that I don't understand anyone, that was so frustrating. Because I spent with it like hundreds, maybe thousands of hours. It was basically useless. I could read some little books, but useless. I started to uh, be proficient, you know, be very, um, uh, very good in Burmese only after about four or five years of learning Burmese. And uh, then it was easy. So then I understand and people understand 
we can resolve problems, we can plan things. No problem. I feel in Burmese, you know, I'm like at home. For me, Burmese language is now almost like Czech. It's very familiar. It's very natural. Not reading. I'm not so fast in reading. Czech is definitely easier in English. But Burmese is very natural for me to talk. So it takes time and a huge amount of effort. But I think it's worth it. As soon as you learn Burmese, your door to the deathless is open. The door to Nibbana, door to enlightenment, the door to the best teachings of Buddhism, which all is available in, in Burmese, will be entirely open to you. I am so proud, you cannot imagine, so proud that I can speak in Burmese and can read Burmese books and I can understand everything that's there. So good. Yes, Tilly? Is it a bad thing to be too proud? The question just, I just thought of it. If you are proud as appreciating what good you have done, then that's fine. But if you are proud in the way that you compare with others, then that's bad. Oh yeah, that's kind of, I agree. Okay, so it was a pleasure to see everybody. Uh, we didn't do much with the, uh, with the teens, but I will definitely give you three refuges and five precepts. So um, the preteens can go. It was a pleasure to see everybody and uh, see you next week. You don't have any homework, so enjoy your week. Bye. And I will continue with the Bye. teens. Bye, See everybody. Bye. Sorry, I'm slow. I'm very slow. Okay. You're not many, right? You're missing quite a few people. No problem. So I will give I will give you three features, five precepts, and uh, we can enjoy a week without homework. Well, uh, Alma will have to do his homework, <laughs> but. Uh, the others who have done it uh, will have some vacation. So I would like to ask everyone to unmute. Yamahan Vadami Tangvadeta. Ahambhante. 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 Isaranena Saha. Isaranena Saha. Pancha silang dhammang ya jami. Pancha silang dhammang ya jami. Anugahang katwa. Anugahang katwa. Silang deta me bhante. Silang deta me bhante. Anukampang upadaya. Anukampang upadaya. Dutiyampi aham bhante. Dutiyampi aham bhante. Isarane na saha. Isarane na Pancha silang dhammang ya jami. Pancha silang dhammang ya jami. Anugahang katwa. Anugahang katwa. Silang deta me bhante. Silang deta me bhante. Anukampang upadaya. Anukampang upadaya. Tati ampi aham bhante. Isarani na saha. Pancha silang dhammang ya jami. Pancha silang dhammang ya jami. Anukkahan katwa. Anukkahan katwa. Silang deta me bhante. Anukampang upadaya. Anukampang upadaya. Yaza and Sandy, are you in the same room? Yeah. yeah. Uh, where are you? Are you at home or in a hotel? We're actually in New York, right? You're in New York. Yes, I was wondering. So why didn't you come to see me? We'll be there right? tomorrow. Karen. You're coming tomorrow? Where? Where shall we meet? Shall we meet in Port Washington or in... Uh, Lindbrook or yes oh so Tenza is also in New York what can I do? 
So Tenza is also in New York. You're yeah. there also with Tenza. Yeah, we're okay. all here in the same one hotel room. So. Oh, I see. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it's easier for us to get out of the city or tomorrow when we leave than going in and out with the traffic. So we decided to not come out today. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's it's better to combine it. So when where shall we meet tomorrow? We thought you will be in Port Washington tomorrow. I'm going to Port Washington um, probably by half past ten. Yeah, Mark, the video will maybe like in the afternoon, Shimpia, like after yeah, coming out of the city, we plan to yeah. come to you. I should be in Port Washington uh, perhaps by, by the midday and I yeah, will Mark. be there until the midnight, uh, until the other day. So um, yeah, if you come anytime after the midday, we will surely, surely meet there. Yeah. And Tenza, is Tenza now fine? Yes, she's fine now, she's here. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. So let's continue. Buddhang saranang Oh, okay. Namota sabhagavato arahato samma sambuddhasa. No more does it not be not being Dutiyampi buddhang saranangga chami dutiyampi dhammang saranangga chami dutiyampi sanghang saranangga chami Tati yampi buddhang saranangga chami tati yampi dhammang saranangga chami tati yampi sanghang saranangga chami saranagamanang paripunnang Panati pata vera manisika padang samadhyami. So, uh, what is that precept, Sandy? No killing. Adinadana vera manisika padang samadhyami. Adinadana vera manisika padang samadhyami. What does that mean, Alma? Kame sumicha jara vera manisika padang samadhyami. Yes, what does that mean? I believe it was no adultery. Excuse me? No adultery. No adultery, that's right. Musavada vera manisika padang samadhyami. So, Sandy, what does that mean? No lie. Mm -hmm. Sura meraya machapamada dhana vera manisika padang samadhyami. Sura meraya machapamada dhana vera manisika padang samadhyami. So, Alma, what does that mean? Uh, no intoxicating drugs or alcohol. Yes. Tisaranena sadding pancha silang dhammang sadhukang surakhitang katva appamadena sampadeta. Nice. May you be happy, may you be healthy. May you soon attain the eternal bliss of Nibbana. Nice. Okay. So it was a pleasure to see everybody and hope to see you next time.
No homework? No new homework? Bye. 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 Bye.